Hello loves, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Elizabeth and I welcome you to subscribe. And in today's video, I want to show you my winter curly hair routine. What I like to do first, I like to make a little line on the side because that's how I like to style my hair. All the products that I'm using in this video, I will put them down below for you guys. Right after that, I like to separate my hair in three parts because it's easier for me to style it. So before I style my hair, I have to add plenty of water so that my hair doesn't get dry or frizzy and also so that my hair can suck in all the products that I'm going to add. In order for my back not to get wet, I either use a t-shirt or sometimes I use like a, like a regular towel. So for my second step, the first product I'm going to be adding is the Count to Chia Butter Moisturizing Curl Activator Cream. This cream, I just got it and it's really, really good and it smells amazing like mango, but it moisturizes my curls really good. Always make sure that I spread it through all of my hair and also untangle my hair at the same time. For my next step, I use the Olive Oil Echo Gel, which does wonders on my hair and it keeps your hair really moisturized. So after I apply all the products on my hair, I am going to be taking little pieces of hair and curling them with my finger. And I'm going to make sure that I untangle them from the top to the bottom. They need to be untangled, otherwise they can get frizzy. Then I will be showing you guys that I don't do that in my whole head, just a few pieces of my hair. And after I am done curling the little pieces of my hair, I like to scrunch up for more curlings. Out of bounds, I can only be free. Out of bounds, if you and basically I do the same process for the rest of my hair. It's that simple. As you can see, I didn't do the little curls on that side of my hair because I only do them where I can see them when they dry. I gotta make sure that I untangle my hair because if I leave my hair tangled, once my hair dries, it would be very, very frizzy and I do not want that. Like a lightning Out of bounds, I can only be free Out of bounds, if you're waiting for me Out of, out of, out of bounds Under the frozen light We are a picture of the thousand nights We won't come down
you can see here, my hair gets really, really dry quick. So I gotta make sure I add a lot of water so that the products can, um, so that my hair can suck in all the products good. Okay, you guys, we're almost there. Doing our hair takes a lot of work, patience, dedication, and love. But at the end of the day, it's all worth it. Why don't you sing along, my friend? For it's our last refrain. Forever young, ever strong, ever brave. Memories like this never end. No, they don't fade away. So when I'm Now I'm going to dry my hair with a diffuser on high cool temperature for a few minutes because I'm going to do half, um, half air dry and half diffuser dry. So the way I like to dry my hair, I like to put the diffuser on top of my roots first and make sure that my roots are dry first and then I go from the bottom to my roots and then I do just the bottom. This is actually a long, little bit of a long process. Here it seems like it's fast, but it's not. Um, but I just did it for the video so it can be faster. But this is a process that takes patience, and but that's why I like to do half diffuser and half air dry. Okay, so here my hair is about 80% dry. After this, I'ma just let it air dry. That's it, finally, my hair is 100% dry. Now, once it's like this, I like to just shake it, shake it, shake it off, and my hair gets a lot of volume. And that's all I do for volume. I don't really have to do much. But that's it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you guys on my next video. Bye-bye.